you know, how are they going to do? Well, having no idea what to expect. As oh my god, just going he just in. flashes onto no, Trick, gets been achieved. By Sword, a lot of damage potential on there as there's the Nah back. They spot Trick already, but is it too late? Is Crazy just going to get taken down? First Blood goes over to that massive Trundle in the hands of... This should be have been communicated to Trick, you'd hope. Well, he's going to get knocked up and destroyed. The download was complete. Not quite enough damage on this Dragon, and now Tempt and Trick with their lane priority are actually going to be able to move up here and re-leash. Deep teleport coming in. Yeah, they're actually looking for this one as Tempt is going to get himself over the wall. Really good Narbar from Sword, but remember, doesn't have the ultimate yet. There's the Empress Divide, but the Flash comes in and Sword really wants this one. Tarzan going to flash over Tempt. The first one to go down is now Ghost has found his way in to the backline. Lahan soaking so much damage for his team. And Trovi comes over with the Flash. He's going to be able to get the heal. The Dragon just going to be ignored at this moment as Tarzan going to get the King's Tribute and goes up to a pretty high health number. About 300 from that one. The, day, the results indicate they're going to kill on Temp thanks to a fantastic TP timing and Alistair dies. Yep. That's just going to be picked up by a really good amount of vision from BBQ. Window shopping is always a problem. Trick looking to turn it into even more here as well. A supercharger used by Viper. Sword. Full information actually over to BBQ. Knock up still not going to quite register. Really good stopwatch to come in from Chovy. But it's still one versus three for Tarzan. Oh, the cask was stunning out of Trick. Denies the ultimate, but it's not enough. In comes Kaisa with that killer instinct, and Ignar is going to get taken down. Ghost thankfully went for a little bit of a ride, and there's no more dashes to get over these walls. Be better when you realize how much of an advantage and how much they were set up to win. And speaking of being set up to win, that yep, Realm Warp is actually going to bring everyone on top of Sword, but can he get under the turret in time is the question. Fair bit of damage goes down, but Teleport. Yep. He's going to go 11 and 0, getting close to the longest streak we've seen is okay. Yeah, there's the Headbutt Pole. We are going to get the Killer Instinct proccing off that, and Viper just eliminates the Ezreal. Ezreal got the 15 minutes here. Trick and Viper. Let's see how this one goes. Yeah, well, it's one Viper versus three members of BBQ. They do land the first off, but it's a great flash to get Viper out of the way. He's going to ult himself just for the shield, as there's the headbutt pole from Lahans. True Shot Barrage not going to find anything now, as Trick has to flash to get out all five members. Oh! Looking for more, but there's a flash now from Sword. We are waiting for the team fight plays out of this Nar, and it looked stunning. Viper is going to fall down, but they've still got enough damage here. Ghost finds himself one versus three. It is going to get pummeled. It's a double kill for Chovy's Velkars. And Griffin thinking about going towards the Baron. No wall it's slower than they may have respected, but that's going to be Baron. Viper's going to get the buff as well. He's already respawned. He looked a bit upset that he actually died he during that one. Now, the teams that are going to be make it, making it into those playoffs, assuming that the best team wins every given day, is I'm going to have to interrupt this one as Sword's going to get thrown underneath this turret. He nars, but I have a feeling he's just going to go down. The turret is going to help out as well, and BBQ. Be a yeah, nah moment as Ignar is trying to interrupt the acceleration here. This is a nice use of the Realm Warp. Yeah, Viper's actually charged up his Rage Blade that's newly built Ghost out of the fight now as well as the Ezreal is way too low. Good knock up onto Crazy who is just stuck in position. And now Griffin are going to follow Shelly to take down the first inhibitor turret of the game. I like the Rise getting a melee range of Viper only at the tail end. Understood the Ezreal was there too. Ezreal gets DPSed out and uh, well, Seems like likely that they're going to be able to kill Shelly if they can't. The Dancing Ripto is still on. Yep, might actually happen here as you can't actually do that trick. It's not how that interaction works. Shelly finally going to get taken down, but a charge onto a Nexus turret is huge. Chovy. Watching Nar actually in the zoomed out picture here. Yeah. Nar alone is enough to dissuade them. And uh, they're just going to take it. It's all too easy. With some priority for themselves, it certainly is a good move, but Temp just going to throw away his ultimate and his life as well as the flash comes in from Viper. So much damage out from the Kaiser, but outplaying Temp as well on his favorite pick. The double tap as well on the Q from Trovi, they'll immediately get rid of that inhibitor as now Lahans looks for the body slam, doesn't quite get it. Disintegration Ray though, just gets rid of the Brawn Sword. Not, gonna a not able to find Ghost there as gets out with the Arcane Shift, but BBQ just have to watch their structures get destroyed. Sword even wants more, but the Nexus is going to be in the eyes of Griffin. The 2-0 is there, and now KT need to 2-0 MVP. Otherwise, it's a Griffin in first place waiting in the LCK final for Summer 2018.